ஹே எவ்ரிபடி குட் மார்னிங் அண்ட் வெரி வெரி வாம் வெல்கம் ஆன் திஸ் கோல்டு சில்லி வின்டரி மார்னிங் அண்ட் அ பிக் ஹாய் ஃப்ரம் பூஜா ஜோஷி ஈஸி இங்கிலீஷ் எக்ஸ்ப்ளனேஷன் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு கண்டினியூ வித் த ஃபோர்த் பார்ட் ஆஃப் த லெசன் நம்பர் எயிட் மூமெண்ட்ஸ் சப்ளிமெண்ட்ரி ரீடர் நைன்த் ஸ்டாண்டர்ட் புக் அண்ட் லெசன்ஸ் நேம் இஸ் ஹவுஸ் இஸ் நாட் ஏ ஹோம் fourth video first three videos i have already posted so you can see any time and learn with in english as well as hindi totally and with lots of fun so here in short i would like to tell you about what happens in the lesson previously what's the story about here one writer girl's house is burnt but as well as she has taken uh, admission in the new that is a higher high school and uh, she also has a cat which is destroyed or which is missing actually in the fire which takes place uh, in writer girl's house so she has to leave the house and will she find her cat will she be back to normal life again will she able to solve the things will she able to take care and control of the situation and how will she manage herself let's see as usual i will read and tell you the words to learn meanings new words then you will have the explanation in english english and hindi that week the rubble that used to be our house was being cleared of the lot even though we had rented a, an apartment nearby i would go over and watch them clear away debris hoping that my cat was somewhere to be found she was gone i kept thinking about her as that vul- vulnerable little kitten in the early morning when i would disturb her and get out of bed she would tag along after me climb up my robe and crawl into my pocket to fall asleep i was missing her terribly show me let me show you the meaning of rubble and debris vulnerable is the meaning of rubble pieces of broken brick stone damaged building like toote makan ka malba the remains same debris also pieces from something that has been destroyed in an accident especially and vulnerable very weak and easy to hurt फिजिकली और इमोशनली जिसे आसानी से मानसिक और शारीरिक तरीके से आघात पहुँचाया जा सके दर्द दिया जा सके ओके ना लेट मी टेल यू द एक्सप्लेनेशन दैट वीक द रूबल इज दैट सेम कंटिन्यूड वीक देन दैट वेन द फायर टू प्लेस then the ruble दैट इज वंस यूज टू बी हर हाउस नाउ इट वॉज अ रूबल ओनली सम डेब्रिज was there only the remains of the house were there even then she wished uh, she used to go there from school and she used to watch the people clear away the debris debris as i told you the meaning whatever the remains from uh, and build a building or a property after being damaged by an accident or so they had already rented an apartment taken a house on rent and she always used to remember her one vulnerable little kitten the kitten which was very very weak very small easy to be uh, easy to be hurt physically or emotionally and the cat used to uh, when writer girl used to disturb her the cat used to get uh along after her she used to just climb up her robe and slowly uh, reach into the pocket to fell asleep in the pocket of the 
writer girl's robe and writer girl was missing her terribly terribly means badly she was missing her यहाँ पे इस हफ्ते जो आग लगने के बाद का हफ्ता है तो उसका हाउस तो एक मलबे में के ढेर में परिवर्तित हो गया था जैसे एक मलबे का ढेर था टूटी फूटी चीज़ें थी अंदर टूटा ईंट पत्थर के टुकड़े थे रह गए थे और तब भी ये राइटर हमारी ये जाके वहाँ पे स्कूल के बाद वहाँ बैठती थी देखती थी कि वहाँ जब सब मलबे को साफ़ करते हुए वो देखती थी और साथ ही आशा रखती थी कि शायद उसकी कैट कहीं दिख जाए पर कैट तो नहीं थी कहीं नहीं थी और वो हमेशा उनके बारे में सोचती रहती थी कि कैट कितनी वलनरेबल कितनी आसानी से चोट पहुंचाई जा सके ऐसी छोटी सी प्यारी सी थी और जब भी वो कैट को सुबह उठ के डिस्टर्ब करती और बेड से बाहर निकलती तो कैट उनके पीछे आती और धीरे से उनकी कुर्ते में उनके पहने हुए कपड़े में चढ़ जाती और उनके गाउन में चढ़ जाती और धीरे से पॉकेट के अंदर सोने के लिए चली जाती हाँ वो सच में कैट को बहुत मिस कर रही थी इट ऑलवेज सीम्स दैट बैड न्यूज़ स्प्रेड्स क्विकली एंड इन माय केस इट वाज नो डिफरेंट एवरीवन इन हाई स्कूल इंक्लूडिंग द टीचर्स वॉज अवेयर ऑफ माई प्लाइट आई वॉज एम्बेरस्ड एज इफ सम हाउ आई वेर रिस्पॉन्सिबल What a way to start off at new school! This was not the kind of attention I was looking for. जैसे कि bad news was there, it was a bad news. It spe- spreads very quickly. If it is a good thing and we really want to spread, then it will take some time to spread that news. But bad news it spreads very quickly, like fire in the forest. So everyone was able to know and had got the news of writer's plight. Plight means our fate. Plight. Okay. That what had happened with her, and writer felt embarrassed. Embarrassed means feeling shy. I'll show you the meanings. And like writer was responsible for lighting that fire or. for having the house on fire and everybody looked at him sympathetically which he she did not like it and she felt that what a terrible way what a bad way what a negative way to start off a new start off at the new school she everybody likes attention but this was not the kind of attention which writer girl was looking for so yahan pe jaise ki बुरी खबरें बहुत ही जल्दी जैसे जंगल में आग की तरह फैलती हैं वैसे इनके केस में भी ये अलग नहीं थी बात बहुत जल्दी ये खबर फैल गई कि राइटर कल के घर में आग लग चुकी है उनके पास कुछ सामान नहीं था और सबको पता चल गया था जिससे कि वो बड़ी खुद पर शर्म महसूस करती थी और एम्बेरस होती थी और उन्हें ये बिल्कुल अच्छा नहीं लगता था ये ये कैसा तरीका है एक नए स्कूल में ज्वाइन करने का उसकी शुरुआत करने का एक नए शुभ जीवन की शुरुआत करने का ये कौन सा तरीका है और उन्हें ऐसा लगता था जैसे सब ये कह रहे हो कि जैसे वो खुद रिस्पॉन्सिबल थी अपने घर में आग लगने देने के लिए द नेक्स्ट डे एट स्कूल पीपल वेर एक्टिंग इवन मोर स्ट्रेंज दैन यूजल आई वॉज गेटिंग रेडी फॉर फॉर जिम क्लास एट माई लॉकर पीपल वेर मिलिंग अराउंड मी आस्किंग मी टू हरी अप I thought it strange but in the light of the past few weeks nothing would surprise me it almost seemed that they were trying to show me into the gym then i saw why there was a big table set up with all kinds of stuff on it just for me they had taken up a collection and bought me school supplies notebooks all kinds of different clothes jeans tops sweat suits it was like christmas i was overcome by emotion people who had never spoken to me before were coming up to me to introduce themselves i got all kinds of invitation to their houses the next day at school it was very very ex- uh, exciting and little bit strange not exciting the people were acting stranger than usual so she felt that what is actually happening she was not able to understand she was getting ready for gym class and people were milling around milling around and 
showing me into gym see here the meaning of milling and show me into the gym they were people were just gathering around her and asking her to hurry up she was thinking it as strange but in the light of few past weeks had gone with her nothing would surprise me she was ready for almost everything she felt that nothing in the world could shock him like the burning of the houses getting admission in new school the losing of cat dear one's pet cat so nothing would su surprise more than that so she was ready but when they tried to show her into the gym show means they tried to literally push her into the gym then she saw why there was a big table in that all kind of things were placed there just for the writer girl there were, were school supplies books notebooks all kinds of stationeries maybe jeans tops sweatshirts clothes like that everything was there for her they were trying to help her out with giving lots and lots of uh, by giving lots and lots of present and it seemed to her like a christmas day she was very overcome she was filled with emotion people who had never talked to her before that time they were coming up to her and introduced themselves they were behaving very nicely which was liked by the author and she got attention and invitation to their houses she was very very happy by this of course she will be and people were trying to help her out let me show you the meaning of milling and show milling means moving around in a large mass they were milling around the author and here show show means to push along to push or put in a rough careless or hasty manner to number 3 3 meaning to force by other than physical now yes their genuine outpouring of concern really touched me in that instant i finally breathed a sigh of relief and thought for the first time that things were going to be okay i made friends that day now what happened here yahan par kya hota hai ki agle din school mein people thoda aur ajeeb sa unka vyavhar rehta hai behavior rehta hai जो राइटर ने नहीं एक्सपेक्ट किया होता है जैसे राइटर जिम क्लास के लिए रेडी हो रही होती हैं पीपल उन्हें उनके आसपास उन्हें घेर लेते हैं और उन्हें जल्दी से जल्दी तैयार होने के लिए जल्दी जिम में जाने के लिए कहते हैं क्योंकि उन लोगों का ऑलरेडी एक प्लान है कि इनको क्रिसमस की तरह गिफ्ट दें जैसे कि इनका हाउस जल चुका है तो सब पैसे इकट्ठे करके डोनेशन्स रिसीव करके उनके लिए काफ़ी सारी चीज़ें ले आते हैं जैसे कि किताबें कापियाँ नोटबुक्स और स्कूल रिलेटेड सब सामग्री उनके लिए जीन्स टी शर्ट्स और स्वेट शूट्स उनके लिए पहनने के लिए स्वेटर कोट जैसा और ये सब ले आते हैं जिससे कि उन्हें फील होता है कि आज क्रिसमस है वह बहुत ही खुश हो जाती हैं भावनाओं से भर जाती हैं जिन लोगों ने उनसे कभी बात भी नहीं करी थी वे लोग सामने से आते हैं और अपने आप को अपना परिचय देते हैं उन्हें और अपने घर आने के लिए कहते हैं उस दिन उन्हें बहुत इनविटेशन मिलते हैं अपने घर बुलाते हैं लोग उन्हें और इतना प्यार और इतना दुलार केयर देखकर कर इन्हें बहुत ही अच्छा लगता है और उनका उन्हें छू जाते हैं उनका दिल छू जाता है और इसके बाद वे एक शांति की सांस लेती हैं और उन्हें फर्स्ट टाइम ऐसा लगता है कि अब शायद सब कुछ अच्छा हो रहा है सब ठीक होने वाला है और उस दिन वो दोस्त भी बनाती हैं शी मे मेड फ्रेंड्स दैट डे शी थॉट दैट फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम नाउ एवरीथिंग आफ्टर द फायर एवरीथिंग विल बी नॉर्मल एंड बी बैक शी विल बी बैक टू अर नॉर्मल लाइफ अ मंथ लेटर आई वॉज एट माई हाउस वॉचिंग दम रीबिल्ड इट बाई दिस टाइम इट वॉज डिफरेंट आई वॉज इन टू I was with two of my new friends from school. It took a fire from me for me to stop focusing on my feelings of 
in security and open up to all the wonderful people around me now i was sitting there watching my house being rebuilt when i realized my life was doing the same thing ek uh, one month passes by now she is at her house watching the house again that house was getting rebuilt again but by this time the things were different she wasn't feeling alone she wasn't alone and she was uh, with her two new friends from school and it took her fire in the house to understand that we can mix up with all the kinds of people if we want to if we are good then the whole world will be good to us there is lot beautiful and wonderful things in the world to see us and then she was sitting and watching her house being rebuilt her house had been made again it was under construction and she realized then my life is also under construction may my life is also rebuilding like the house ek mahine के बाद आग लगने के बाद एक महीना बीत जाता है और इस बार वो अपने घर को बनता हुआ देख रही हैं दोबारा से बनता हुआ देख रही हैं पर अब वो अकेली नहीं है उनके साथ उनकी दो और स्कूल की फ्रेंड्स हैं जो नई फ्रेंड्स उन्होंने स्कूल में बनाई हैं एक आग लगी तब उन्हें समझ में आया कि असुरक्षा की भावनाएँ थी उन पर फोकस करना छोड़ के अगर हम शुरुआत करें पहल करें अगर हम अच्छे हैं तो हम लोगों को से भी अच्छा व्यवहार की उम्मीद रख सकते हैं हमें दुनिया में बहुत खूबसूरत और सुंदर चीज़ें और लोग देखने को मिलेंगे और अगर हम उनके साथ अच्छे नहीं हैं तो हमें हमें भी वैसा ही मिलेगा सामने ना और अब ये बैठे बैठे देख रही हैं कि उनका घर बन रहा है और साथ ही साथ उनकी ज़िंदगी भी बन रही है जैसे एक नई शुरुआत कर रही है उनकी ज़िंदगी और सब कुछ अच्छा हो रहा है while we sat there on the curb planning my new bedroom i heard someone walk up to me from behind and say does this belong to you when i turned around to see who it was i couldn't believe my eyes a woman was standing there holding my cat i left i leapt up and grabbed her out of the woman's arms i held her close to me and cried into beautiful or that beautiful orange fur she purred happily my friends were hugging me hugging the cat and jumping around jaise wo wahan pe baithe the ek platform jaise pe baithe the aur apni new bedroom ki planning kar rahi thi aur unhe piche aisa laga jaise kisi ne piche se awaaz di aur poocha ki kya ye aapka hai ya aapki hai जैसे जैसे ही राइटर पीछे मुड़ के देखते हैं उन्हें अपनी आंखों पर विश्वास ही नहीं होता एक औरत एक स्त्री वहाँ पे खड़ी थी जिनके पास जिन्होंने मेरी बिल्ली पकड़ के रखी थी उसने राइटर ने तुरंत पकड़ लिया और कैट को और अपने हाथों में बिल्ली को ले लिया और अच्छे से उनको बिल्ली को क्लोज अपने रख के अपने पास रख के बहुत ज़्यादा वो रोए अपनी बिल्ली को पकड़ के क्योंकि उसका ब्यूटीफुल ऑरेंज फर बहुत टाइम बाद उन्होंने उसको अपनी गोद में लिया था और कैट भी अपना आवाज़ें निकालने लगी खुशी से फ्रेंड्स राइटर के फ्रेंड्स उन्हें भी हक कर रहे थे और उनकी बिल्ली को भी गले लगा रहे थे और कूद रहे थे खुशी से उछल रहे थे नाउ इन इंग्लिश when uh, the writer and her friends they were sitting and then planning for the new bedroom then what happened somebody walked somebody came from back behind and asked whether this belongs to you then uh, when that writer turns to see that who it was she couldn't believe her eyes a woman was standing and holding writer's cat which was taken to be dead or long lost and writer was so happy he just she just grabbed from the uh, lady's arms and tightly pressed close that beautiful orange fur beautiful orange fur of the cat and cat also made very uh, happy noises she purred and friends hug gave hugs to writer her cats a cat and jumped around with happiness apparently my cat had been so freaked by the fire 
that she had ran over a mile away her caller had our phone number on it but our phones had been destroyed and disconnected this wonderful woman took her in and worked hard to find out whose cat it was somehow she knew that this cat was loud and sorely missed her cat what had happened actually in the fire the cat ran away it was so freaked it was so uh, fearful that it just ran over a mile away her caller had a phone number of the writer but phones were already destroyed and disconnected in the fire that took place so maybe that lady is giving calls but nobody was able to pick up the phone this wonderful woman she took trouble she worked hard she find out that actually whether this cat belongs to somebody or is somebody missing that cat badly यहाँ पे एक बिल्ली आग के वक्त इतनी डर गई थी सहम गई थी कि वो बहुत ही दूर दौड़ती दौड़ती चली गई तकरीबन एक मील के आसपास उसके गले के पट्टे पे कॉलर के पट्टे पे राइटर का फ़ोन नंबर लिखा हुआ था पर राइटर के फ़ोन आग में उनका नाश हो गया था जल गए थे ख़राब हो गए थे तो उससे वो फ़ोन लगा नहीं पा रही थी जिनके पास इनकी बिल्ली थी पर तब भी इस शानदार वुमेन ने शानदार लेडी ने बहुत तकलीफ़ ली और उन्होंने मेहनत करके पता लगाया कि ये बिल्ली किसकी है और कौन इस बिल्ली को आ, कोई ना कोई इस बिल्ली को बहुत प्यार करता है और हो सकता है कि उन्हें मिस कर रहा हो उन्हें बहुत याद कर रहा हो एज आई सैट देर विथ माई फ्रेंड्स माई कैट कॉल्ड अप इन माई लैब all the overwhelming feelings of loss and tragedy seemed to diminish i felt gratitude for my life my new friends the kindness of a stranger and the loud purr of my beloved cat my cat was back and so was i when the writer was sitting there with the friends cat just uh, in a round position she just twisted in the ball lap of the writer and there were overwhelming feelings very very strong emotional feelings of loss and tragedy and seemed to diminish they just feelings of loss and tragedy feelings vanished from there now the writer felt gratitude means she thanked to god for the new life new friends the kindness of a stranger which the stranger showed by keeping the cat and trying to search the cat uh, cat's owner she had done a wonderful job and the loud purr of beloved cat so now the writer was happy with her life writer was happy that she had got her cat back she was happy that the house was made it was under construction they were building a new house then the writer was happy she was in new big school so the writer was happy that she had got new friends and she was happy that she had received kindness of a stranger she felt thankful to life her cat was back and writer girl was also back back means back to the normal life with lots of love and happiness the writer was very very happy in the end with this i end the last part that is the fourth video of the lesson number 8 standard 9 moments supplementary reader book a house is not a home now were you able to know that why a house only is not a home so take care bye bye see you